Corn School is brought to you by BASF and Pride Seeds. One of the questions we often get is how, when, and where does disease impact yield and how it goes about. And if we look at a, this plant here, it's very typical. These leaves down low are, are often act as our early indicator of disease presence. And so these res residue in this field is ideal for overwintering of uh, pathogens, going from one season to the next. And that acts as our wonderful inoculum source for, for these pathogens to develop. And in many cases, you'll see things like northern corn leaf blight, gray leaf spot, start from residue from the soil, work their way up the plant. And then as it works up the plant, this is the zone. This is the key component or the key area that you want to be protected from a yield standpoint. It's these leaves, the ear leaf and those just below and above. And above the ear is, is key. You can see here in our inoculated trials, we target that area. We target the ear leaf zone. And here we've got some wonderful disease. We've got some wonderful infection. So when it comes to how, when, and where, this is where all the action is. This is where the yield is driven for a lot of these corn hybrids and corn yields. And this is the area we want to be protected. Another big question we often get asked is when does disease occur? And so as we, as we look at the plant here, looking at the location, Early on, you'll see the disease developing down low. Again, that's an indicator that it's either residue borne or moving up the plant. The, the middle part, again, shows that movement up. And then those late um, infections, where normally in most cases we'll see disease starting to show, in the, like in this case with northern corn leaf blight, you'll start seeing it up at the top. Um, that is normal and by that time when we start seeing lesions or leaves that are infected say the top two three leaves that usually is not a big uh, risk factor from a yield standpoint when it comes to when we see disease early on movement of that disease up the plant targeting that critical midsection of the uh, the ear leaf in that area that factory zone that maximizes yield that's where you can have your biggest impact on on yield deficit from from disease and there are inoculated trials we can get with northern corn leaf blight for instance anywhere from 20 to 40 bushels where we've got disease that has um, infected the bottom to the mid part of the plant. Late infection, low risk. Is that um, a need to, to concentrate on those late infections? Probably not. So when you look at your strategy, when and where, it's the bottom part of the plant, that ear um, zone is key in terms of targeting or using, maximizing your strategy to minimize disease loss.